Hello and welcome back. When we left off, the, oh, wow, they're not following us. Deep. Guess it leads down to whatever the white pumpkin calls home. I wonder how yes. he gets down there. Maybe in addition to walking through walls, he can fly for all we know. Ugh. Damn. It's just, I'm really worried about Lucas. Those people think they're all safe, but the white pumpkin is still running around, and he could strike again at any minute. Not to mention, all those people back there have been so ungrateful, so petty. Ugh! Just so frustrated. Petra, don't worry. We're gonna stop the white pumpkin way before he can hurt anyone else. It's gonna be fine. You're right. I know you're right. <sighs> Sorry, Jesse. I, I just really needed to get that off my chest. Fair enough. We're gonna get through this. Let's start by figuring out how we're gonna get down there, huh? You know the well, drill. didn't he use those? Inventory? Didn't you have all those wood blocks? Oh, yeah. I thought he was using those um orbs. Oh, jeez, I forget what they're Sorry, called. Sorry, I was with the teleport earlier. ones. Nervous habit. Well, luckily those should do just the trick. All right, time to build a ladder. Are you thinking ladder? Yeah. Gonna need a lot of them. Yeah. I'll race you. <laughs> You're on. Done. Don't. Oh, man. Done. <laughs> Thanks. I needed that. All right, we got oh, a she's lot just gonna more take of these to make. Let's get to work. Oh, thank goodness, we don't have to actually do it. Okay, that's one down. Lots more to go. It's going to be difficult to do it going downwards. <sighs> Should we have gotten some torches? Seems pretty dangerous to go down here in the dark. See? The signs of deduction. Think? Yeah, I just hope this works. You think we're gonna find a white pumpkin down here? With all these secret passageways, it's so hard to tell where he might be. I'll be honest, I hope we do. What if that weird this cave we saw earlier, what if that's scale. involved? Brutal. I like it. I think we're underwater because I can see dripping. Hey, do you hear lots and lots of zombies? Yeah, I do. Starting to smell him too. Oh, ditto. Gross. What if he's the one creating them? Oh, it might be a grinder <gasps> how he gets some supplies. Well, that explains all the zombie noises. What are these? Jail cells? Sewers? Don't really like the look of them. Spawner? What in the world is that? <laughs> oh, some sort of like zombie spawner. Does that mean the white pumpkin actually made the sea of zombies outside? That's Might have been like. to try and keep everyone here. Geez, he must have a way of getting rid of them then. Unless his plan is just to, you know, escape and go to the temple, c What's condemn that? the world as it is. Uh, this is what Elicard had. Yeah, it's a grinder. Oh wait, no. No, these are people's loot, I think. I think this is where people's stuff goes after those hoppers upstairs suck it up. You're right. I think that's Lizzie's. Okay, but where's the loot going from here? Hopefully right to the white pumpkin. Hey, you see the light coming out of that tunnel too, right? Huh? Oh, yeah. And it doesn't look like it's blocked off like all the, uh, zombie film ones. If we can get up there, I think we might be able to follow the loot to wherever it's going. Well, that's awesome. Nice what? find. How do you want to get up there? What if this entire world is built of zombies, or if it's just this area? Yeah. 
But if so, that would explain how, like, stampy he is that he has 900 fans in this world. Okay, I think we can jump from here. Ooh. It's a spider, we can just kill it. Uh. Yeah, gotcha. Oh, that was almost embarrassing. Thanks, Jesse. No problem. Weird. Hmm, I hear it a cat. Sounds like cats. Sort of growing station. Weird. Cool. I'm taking one. The white pumpkin must have heard us. Whoa! Ah! Stampy cat? Boy, you gave me a fright. What are you doing down here? What are we doing down here? Yes, it looks terribly suspicious, you know. We're trying to find the white pumpkin. Oh, well, I'm glad you haven't run into him yet. Come on, you guys! I can't be the White Pumpkin! I'm Stampy Cat! I'm no murderer! Huh? I needed to find you because I have something important to tell you! Okay, what? I have something to confess. Something I haven't told anyone. Where is this going? I stole it from Dan. It was just supposed to be a joke, a harmless prank, but then, well, you've seen what happened. Wow. Who'd have thought? I knew people wanted it, but I had no idea that, that this would happen. But why didn't you tell anyone? I was scared, okay? People started dying, and then I, I didn't want them to think that I did it. Well, he obviously didn't. I mean, the pumpkin's I looking for a that. Thief, but I'm no killer. But that yeah, I know you're not. Is, and he's killing people for it. And now we're down in his lair. I was thinking maybe I should just give it to the white pumpkin. What? Just maybe that would make it all stop, right? Maybe. First, we need to figure out who this white pumpkin really is. Then we'll figure out what to do from there. I, I suppose that's a better strategy. I still hear the cat. If it's just that one, looks then... like a lair door. If I ever saw one. Oh wow! Very creepy. I would not put this in my top ten places I've ever been. Well, there's where the meowing's coming from. Don't it's a worry. Long. We'll get out of here as soon as we find something that proves the white pumpkin's identity. Um, the cat. Petra, did you see this? That's the portal hallway. Yeah, it looks like the white pumpkin's been there too. Wait. If he's been there before, then maybe it is Dan. Let's see. He'd have just been basic lying about if it's an accident. Portals, basic portal theory, portals of you. Wow, they're all about portals. That's pretty obsessive. I mean, only a person who's actually been there would know what it looks like. And he had to he would have had to have had it at one point, so he lost it, and he does all this to try and get it back. Here's where everyone's stuff gets collected. <sighs> Those poor people. You guys doing okay? I'll be honest with you. I'm pretty worried about Lucas. If the white pumpkin isn't down here, he must oh, still wait, be no, up it couldn't. There. We saw him for the portrait. I thought that I was portrait. okay because I was numb and feeling no emotions at all. But I'm beginning to suspect it was actually shock. Don't worry, we're gonna crack this wide open. Unless there's two people. But whom? Eh, crowd tab's not gonna tell us anything. Potion stand. Cobweb. 
weird. Should be able to score some string from those. No, even. That chest definitely seems important. Okay, kitty kitty, can you scoot out of the way, please? We need to get in the chest. Huh. No, bad kitty! Oh, stupid cat. I need something to distract it if I'm gonna get that chest open. Yeah, there's probably something in the other chest. Actually, is there anything down here first? No. Right, the cat's guarding something. Wait, was that some? Oh, for a second, I thought I saw something in there. I'm guessing this chest should have. Oh, yep, we've got sticks. Anything else? Oh, wow, the Ender Pearls. That. Oh, yeah, Sweet. Ender Pearls. Must be how the White Pumpkin got down that elevator shaft. But no fish. Yet, anyway. Alright, I guess I need the cobwebs. Yep, fishing rod. Oh, I'm carrying around the Eversource crown with me. Alright, so what, am I going to use this to get some fish and then use that to get rid of the cat? Oh, to get a fish! Cats love fish! Yeah, now just to figure out where I can catch one. Well, to be honest, I was just going to use this on the cat. Right, there's a lake. Going to be honest, I thought that was the exit. Mr. Cat. Okay, here, kitty. Get the fishy. Oh, I like cats. There oh, he's go. stretching. Jeez. Ooh. Oh, many cats, so many cats. Ugh, cats give me the creeps. No offense, Stampy. None taken. I'm not really a cat. <laughs> finally get in here now. I'm gonna be honest. I like cats, but hordes of oh, things do kind of freak me out. Loads of them. Ooh. Oh, I don't like that. I guess he already had all the X'd out ones ready to go. Wait, that just yep, means. Besides Petra, we've got Dan, Stacy, Stampy, Lucas, Ivor, and oh, hey, there's me. So who what isn't on the list? The cats, the crossed out portraits. Yeah, the it's the cat lady. Portraits. There was one person who didn't have a crossed out portrait. Someone who's a known cat person. Yeah, we kind of guessed from the meow. Well, okay. I kind of guessed from the meow. So who did it? Yes, you I don't know her name. Was it Cat? Yeah, I think it was White Cassie. Pumpkin is Cassie Rose. She's the murderer. Ooh. Oh, man. You're totally right. I don't believe it. Uh... Not only is she the white pumpkin, but she owns way, way too many cats. Well, come on, you guys. It's time to prove Lucas's innocence and catch us a white pumpkin. If we said the others, what do you think would happen? I'll go round everyone up. What's going on? Yeah, you were gone an awful long time. What's going on here? Did you even find anything? We found the white pumpkin's lair right beneath us. What? Really? Yeah. Very interesting. Hello, Cassie. No sign of Cassie, but... Huh? Are you going to tell them, or should I just do it? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Jesse, go on. Is this going where I think this is going? Well, Jesse... Go on, Cassie, tell them. Tell us what, Cass? It sounds like Jesse's trying to make you think that I'm the white pumpkin. <laughs> That's impossible. No way. No way. Yeah, Jesse, I'm afraid you're going to have to do better than that. Look at the facts. 
We caught Lucas with that pumpkin head right after poor Lizzie got taken out. I think you're just lying to protect him. Cassie's making a lot of sense right now. Do you have any evidence to back you up? There's something that's been bothering me for a while now. Something that happened in the Great Hall shortly after Torque Dog was hit with that trap. What's that? Go on, Jesse. You've got this. Where is this going? Shh. Let Jesse finish. Cassie Rose was already in the room. No one else there. And Torque Dog's picture was somehow crossed that, out. That doesn't prove anything. Lucas is still way guiltier looking. Well, what about I was going more for the paintings. Next? When we were down in the basement, we found some very interesting items. Items for the White Pumpkin's evening festivities. And there was one very significant detail. What was this evidence? Shh. I think Jesse's about to tell everyone. The White Pumpkin had portraits all ready to go, pre exed out, one for each of us, except for Cassie. <gasps> Ooh, that's good. <laughs> doing great, Jesse, though. Going for the kill. Metaphorically. It oh. The last piece of evidence, dear friends, that helped me really figure out who we were dealing with here. Cats. Dozens of calico cats. And they all look just like Winslow. An amusing story, Jesse. But if you saw all these supposed cats just like mine, then what color is Winslow? It should He's be orange. a problem if you saw a hundred. Cats? Really? Shh. Winslow is black, white, and orange. Yep. Cassie, is this all true? This whole thing has been about your crazy scheme to get a portal key, hasn't it? Killing whoever gets in your way. How very clever, Jesse. Well, I guess that's it then. You've caught me. No one let him move. The murderer. He's obviously got a trap. I just don't believe this. No, I was shocked too. I'm relieved, but also surprised. Always the quiet ones. But Cassie, I still don't understand why a portal key. I've been stuck in this stupid world with its stupid two moons for years. Trapped with a portal right under my nose, but no key to open it. You can just shed. Until I finally heard that this world's portal key had been found. I knew it was one of you. So I tried my best to earn your friendship. Figure out who had it. Cassie, how could you? We shared cookies together. Cookies! <laughs> you really think that's an excuse? You're pathetic, Cassie. It doesn't excuse all the horrible things you've done. I've spoken just like a person who has no idea what it feels like to be stuck somewhere you don't belong. We need to do don't something belong. with you. Cassie Rose. I vote we build an obsidian prison and surround it with love. No, 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 no. I won't let you do that. I can't. No. Ooh, the cats. This is your fault. You did this to me. <laughs> I'll fight all of you. Each and every one of you. I'll... Oh, another trap. We need to dig her out. After everyone she's hurt, she can dig herself out. She did terrible things, but no one deserves this. So wait, was she the only killer? Oh, she's dead. Wait, look. Oh, what's that gold thing? I can't believe it. She's gone. What a way to go. Yeah, I guess in all the chaos, she forgot where her own traps were. Wow. That's awful. Poor Cassie. She did some terrible things, but no one deserves to be trapped away from home like that. If only she had just asked us for help, we could have avoided this whole thing. Hey, it's morning. I guess this explains why she was so curious about the, guess, you know, I contents of this. Then. Yeah, we're free! And we're alive! Let's not waste it standing around. There could still be traps everywhere in here! Yeah, we could keep the place for ourselves. I've never been so happy to smell rotting flesh. Yeah, that is 
Yikes, that is pretty rank. This looks very familiar. I feel bad thinking about the people who aren't here to smell it. Talk Dog, Sparkles, Lizzie, and Cassie, I guess. Uh, that's a good point. I tried my hardest, but there was nothing I could do. I don't oh, know why, but it was it's not your fault. such a sense of Lucky deja vu about the scene. Here. Speaking of which, I have no idea how to begin finding our exit portal. Well, Cassie said it was right under her nose, right? That's true. Maybe it's nearby. Huh. Hey, what do you know? There it is. It's convenient. A fabulous coincidence! So, I guess this is goodbye, huh? Yeah. Just let us know if you ever accidentally find yourselves in our world. <laughs> That's really nice of you, but I don't think we can really portal hop without a portal key. Oh, uh, well, I think Stampy's got you covered there. You stole the portal key from me? It was just meant to be a prank, a harmless prank, and I'm so sorry, so very, very sorry. Yeah, come on, it's Stampy. You know he would never actually try to hurt anyone. And so the drama continues. Fascinating. Hey, it's, cool <laughs> it's like he's watching a soap opera. You make, like, your own order of the stone. Yeah, all right. I guess I can live with that. Yes, that's a wonderful idea. Well, I'm not great at goodbyes, so... I'm actually just gonna start walking home. Thanks for everything. Oh, yeah, but... me too. Travel safe, you guys. Are they all going together or what? Bye. What a strange, strange bunch of individuals. <laughs> He's still running like that. I see what's her name was talking about being trapped here from another world. What if she was one of the old builders? Portal keys, other worlds. It all adds up, I guess. Man, that's too bad if it's true, seeing as she turned out to be, you know, the white pumpkin and all. Yes. Hadn't thought about that. I just can't believe that we finally met someone who might be an old builder, and she's a pumpkin wearing serial killer. Typical. Well, here we are. Would you care to do the honors, Jesse? That's weird. Winslow? That's strange. I'm not oh. 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 oh, that's spooky. Oh. Actually, not, no, I'm not going to end the episode around here. Oh. This will just be a longer one. I think we're close to the end anyway. A thing. Ooh. Well, that's ominous. Do you hear that? Oh, what the hell are those? And oh. there it is, Jesse! You're trapped. Stuck! <laughs> you know what, actually? I'm going to end this episode around here now, because there's a bit more. <laughs> so, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Please like, rate, or subscribe if you have, and goodbye.